All right, everybody. Music dipped down for a second. Uh, welcome to uh, another. No, not, not another playthrough. Uh, the beginning of a playthrough for uh, the DLC Dawn of War 2 Chaos Rising. Uh, I was hoping that. Um, uh, what you call it? Space Marine. Yeah, uh, Space Marine. <laughs> Deathwing. Uh, had come out, um, but it doesn't look like it's going to be coming out until the 14th, so uh, I think I've got either a uh, uh, a good uh, you know block of time to go through and try to complete this thing in. Um, let me start a new campaign. Yeah. So I tried I tried doing this before, and I was like, wait a second, I better save this service stream. Um, so we're gonna play this before uh, Deathwing comes out, and, and um... only a year ago, the Aurelian Hopefully sector was done. all but doomed. The hive ships of the Tyranids hung over each world, seeding them with obscene creatures. The Tyranids were ready to feast, but these worlds are also the recruiting ground for the Blood Ravens, a chapter of the Emperor's own Space Marines. And they refused to yield. The veteran Targus weathered pitiless alien attacks, allowing Cyrus and his scouts to find weaknesses in our ravenous foes. While Avatus leveled his righteous fury upon the Xenos, Thaddeus descended upon them on wings of fire. And Davian Thule, the first to fall against the Tyranids, returned from death in the form of a mighty dreadnought. You led them all, Commander. Together, you fought across the deserts of Calderas, mm -hmm. through the jungles of Typhon, I and did? beneath the great spire cities of Meridian. You faced an implacable enemy, and you triumphed. I did. But there is a truth more implacable than any Tyranid. A new threat will always emerge. Once, Planet Aurelia was the Sector's crown jewel, home to billions of souls. Then came the Warp Storms. They pushed Aurelia into a new orbit, encased the planet in ice, and swallowed it whole. For a thousand years, the warp held Aurelia in its terrible grip, depositing untold horrors across its surface. Now, planet Aurelia has returned. It should be a barren ball of ice, but a signal is coming from its surface. A blood raven signal. A call for help. Oh, sure. Alright, now hopefully I remember all the controls to this. <laughs> it's, been, uh, it's been a couple days. Weeks. Commander, this is Gabriel Angelos. We have detected a Blood Raven's distress signal coming from somewhere nearby. If there are Chapter Brothers in need, provide support. But be wary of a trap. Angelos out. Our drop pods have scattered, Commander. Something is interfering with the navigation systems. We should locate our other forces and regroup. You got it. Let's do it. We need to get past this wall if we are to locate the other drop pods. Use your jump pack to get across. Alright. Remote detonators and demolition packs are more than enough to bring this gate down. Oh, I see. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Yeah, but do I have any of those? Say oh, now before demo pack. the cleansing begins. Let fly. Be vigilant. Target acknowledged. All right. 
Alright, yeah, I'm remembering the controls. Um, let me, uh, change the sound volume here. Because I think I've got the sound just right, so if it's loud in my ears, it should be loud in your ears. Let's see how this how this goes here. Guardsmen, what are they doing here? Hold your position, Space Marines. I said hold. Lower your weapon, Guardsmen. Yeah. We do not answer to you. Gun them down. I said I can clear those bunkers with explosives. Attacking them with standard weapons takes much more time. Yeah. Acknowledge. <laughs> Scouts here. Still oh. engaged. <laughs> All right. Just always yeah. engaging at range. I was gonna say, where the heck is this? Is that it? Ah. Took forever for that demo thing to refresh. Something sinister is going on here. No loyal guardsman would ever fire on a space marine. I doubt these traitors were alone. Why don't I have a hammer? I mean, this. Oh, hold on. Can't. Yeah. More traitors ahead, and well armed. My scouts wear light armor, Commander, so we had best make use of available cover. Uh, how about. The chapter's recruit Can ready. you. Or the chapter. Yeah. How about that? Why don't you go inside? Alright. That was easy enough. No, didn't lose anybody. Yeah. Teams infiltrate. Select Cyrus. Commander, the immediate area is secure, but this unpopulated glacier is an armed camp. Did this world not just emerge from the warp? If so, someone else got here first. Traitor guardsmen. Just when I was starting to respect them. Hate them if you will, but do not underestimate them. Do not underestimate anybody with a gun. So, it seems like things are just a little bit different. Because there used to be the supply packs. Here they come! Get ready to fire! Traitors! What? Target destroyed. It's a way to do it, bro. Quickly, while Tarkas has their attention, we should engage them at extreme range and focus our fire. Sergeant Tom, the scum incapacitated Tarkas. Commander. Use a stimulant kit to heal him from a distance, or manually revive him. Manually revive him. melee! Cannot slip away! Dark is ready. This oh, kick my is thanks, blood. Commander. Our drop pod took anti-air fire on final approach. Only I made it out, and just barely. And still, you made yourself a target to break that ambush. What would the Codex say about that? The tactical squad shall draw the enemy's fire, thus allowing the Devastator squad to attack from a position of strength. Ha! That it does! This whole situation looks like a trap, but there is still a distress signal transmitting from somewhere nearby. We had best locate its source quickly. We shall. Alright. 
right, so let's just open up with these. The thing is here. Of the fate of the heretic. All right, what do we got? Come on. Alright, so the infiltrate is just the, uh... Standard the Imperial Biz. Locator Relay. Transmitting a generic distress signal using Blood Raven's codes. Hmm. Just enough to lure us in. Post coordinates, 9.6 by 11.12. Launch barrage! Artillery, clear the area! Yo, Brodies. Get out of here. A spotter called in that attack from hiding. Cowards. Run, Space Marines. We should extract and bomb this ice pile from orbit. No, we need to secure an approach before we can launch an extraction. Only logic engines can track and target drop pods. Those systems depend on a broadcast array. Then let us act like space marines. Find the array and destroy it. Just from orbit. Let's do it. Oh, <laughs> and bye. All right. I guess let's find those. Those are relays. I can advance on that turret in tactical formation without being suppressed. Once in range, I can disable it with a frag grenade. All right, Tarkus. Do it. Let fly. Beginning under attack. Target eliminated. Abitus. Yeah. Formation, brother. Let's do it. Go. Just like I said. This looks like a uh, good target. Commander, uh, there is an orbital size. relay ahead. Securing it will give us a defensible fallback position should we need it. It will also allow us to reinforce our squads. Two, one. Structure flattened. There we go. Oh, uh, let's just do one. Whoa! Oh, now How did I not as you even are. look at those guys before? Alright, Alright, do I, um... Actually, what I want to take a look at here is the difficulty to see it. See if I can raise it up a little bit. Or if it's too late, or maybe I'm... Maybe I'm uh, stuck. Can I do game options? Brightness, brightness. There is no difficulty. Dang it, dang it, dang it. So, show subtitles. On. Okay, yeah, everything's on. Good, good, good. Panning? Yeah. No, I don't want to save and exit. Oh, duh. I forgot. I could look at the map. Yeah, right, so that's where we're going to get to. Go this way. Target sighted. <laughs> I could just go through and walk Quick. uh walk the force commander up there and be like Enemy suck it at your back. Under 